Hello, Greg from Balloon Market here, and welcome to BMTV. And as you can see, we're once again joined by Jacob from Amscan. Jacob, hello. Hello, Greg. How are you doing? I'm all right. I didn't recognise Jacob when he walked in the building because you may have noticed. I mean, you, you've probably noticed this already from their own videos and stuff, but all his hair's gone. The locks have been chopped. Many years. In fact, I've only ever known you with long hair. So Yeah, five years. So what's happened? Um, I, I mean, my, I know what's happened. You've yeah, got to cut, cut it off, Greg. Yeah. That's what's happened. <laughs> uh, no, I, I started growing five years ago, and the plan was to cut it off and donate it to the Little Princess Trust. All right. Um, so they make wigs for children who are suffering all sorts of illnesses, um, whether it's cancer and they lose their hair through chemo or whatever else. But um, they make wigs from hair, and they, they do that using donations of hair. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's where my hair is. Uh, hopefully, being made into some wigs. Nineteen inches of hair. Wow. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so it was oh, a lot fantastic. of hair. Fantastic and yeah, a great, yeah. a great cause as well. Thank you. So. Yeah. No, we managed to raise some, some, some good levels of money. So hopefully, yeah. they can uh, use that to, to good use too. Yeah. Brilliant. Anyway, that is that's fantastic. Right. What are we going to do today? Let's get straight into straight it. Through. Okay. So we're going to do. Um, I'm going. I call it the TikTok gender reveal balloon. Okay. I don't know whether that's a, a good term for it or not, but that's what I'm calling it. Okay. So it's that balloon where you, you pop it and the balloon on the inside goes bang. Yes. The one on the outside stays yes. inflated. Yeah. Yes. So people are using dyes and all sorts of things in there to, to get those clouds. We're just going to use confetti and latex balloons today, but that's what we're going to do. Um, I'm not building a design as such, but I'm just going to show the technique to the guy that's down the camera today. Okay. All right. So do, I'm going to ask a question now before yeah, you go get started. So when you do put the, the pin in, because you just put a pin in it, don't yep. you? Does the balloon on the outside go down as well, so the, more slowly? No, so the, well, yes, but over a long, long period of time. So what okay. we're what we've we've worked on is to try and find something that you don't need to give your cost, customer an additional piece of tape or glue dot or whatever it might be. So, using clears and um, trusty stretchy balloon tape, okay. we've we've fathomed out that you can get this balloon to last for a couple of days. So, oh, really? Yeah, absolutely. So so the event is done, dusted, and out of the way, and the customer can celebrate. The gender of their of their baby yeah. without having to worry about sticking a piece of tape over the top. All right. Okay. Cool. So Let's we'll get on it. with it. Let's do yeah. it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, so we're using the Anagram um, Crystal Clears. This is just the standard size, the yep. bigger one. Um, there's a second one there, just in case. You never know. Rick. I'm sure it's, there's not going to be an issue. No, here. there shouldn't be. But just in You've case. You've done this many times. I'm just sure. in case. I'm going to mess up your nice clean floor. Okay. Um, and the first thing we need to do is to get rid of the valve. There are hundreds of BMTVs. I think. I don't, know, I don't know there's hundreds, thousands, but there's, there's a few. <laughs> thousands. Um, so we're going to get rid of the valve. I'm also going to get rid of the, that sticker. It gets in the way as well. Yeah. And we will we'll begin by putting some air into here. That's plenty. Under the arm. Scissors at the ready, nice sharp angle, and out goes the valve. Indeed. It's Indeed. great, isn't it? It is. It's great. Chris always says he finds it very entertaining doing it, even now. It is entertaining. Yeah. It is entertaining. <laughs> um, the next balloon we're going to use, the one on the inside, is the ready-to-pop balloon from Sempertex. Yep. This is a 24-inch reflex gold, so it's not your traditional black balloon. Mm, it's mm. something a little bit different okay. um, to, to, what's, to what's out there <gasps> at the minute. Are people moving away from the black? Um, I don't know if they are moving away from the black, but we 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 sometimes feel that black is really quite harsh. Yeah. yeah. So by using the reflex, it's just a, a point of difference from perhaps your competitors that don't know that there is an alternative Absolutely. to it. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and obviously, if you don't want the ready to pop message, you can use just the regular plain. reflex. Reflex. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm also going to put some air in here, and this is to give me space for when I put things inside the balloon when it's in there. Okay. Um, just to give me some space to work with. I'll do it. Yeah, back out. Come on, just hold in. I'll hold that. So, yeah. Thank you. We'll start prepping this piece. That's something I can do, you see. People ask me go. to hold stuff. I can hold stuff. That's ask me good. to tie knots and. Okay, well, that's for the next video, Greg. And plate stuff. <laughs> hey, we okay. will see. So, I'm just putting the stretching, stretching tool inside the clears and. 
right into the body of the clears. We'll leave that there a second and we'll prepare this guy. This is going to go inside our clears. Well, that's the aim anyway, Greg. Okay. Make sure we're right into the body of the balloon. There we go. That's better. Let me just stuff it in. Stuff it in. That went in very easily. Very, very easily. There we go. And that's that helps with that pre-stretching as well. Mm -hmm. um, just easier to work with, isn't it? And then we just want to roll down the neck. And start putting our uh, our balloons, our confetti, our dye, whatever we want to put in there in the yeah. balloon. Um, the one thing I would say is to avoid sort of um, the plastic confettis. Obviously, when you go pop, and those go everywhere. Yeah, They've yeah. got some sharp edges. Okay. So we're going to use tissue confetti um, and five-inch latex. Who makes this? Uh, Amscan. That would be Amscan, this. wouldn't it? Would. it? Yes, yeah, yeah. So this is some of our um, part of our new. Um, Party Essentials range. Mm -hmm. um, it's a, a cardboard box, so there's none of that plastic um, packets anymore. And in there is um, a lot of confetti. Um, that's really jam packed. Yeah. Uh, weight wise, it's 10 grams. It's plenty enough. Don't need any more than okay. that. Okay. Uh, also comes in pink as well. Not, not just blue. Um, Greg, would you mind? I, I mean, I can try. What do you do? Just, just shove it in there. Just. Take a little bit out. It's going to go yeah, everywhere. It is going to go everywhere. You can do it, obviously, one person, but if you've got someone with you, um, it does make it easier. Oh, you're right. It does go everywhere. How much am I putting it? Oh, it's got two shades. Oh, three shades. Three shades. There's oh. a white, a light blue, and a dark blue in oh, there. Oh, yeah. Um, um, yeah, no, no, no. Don't worry about it. Oh, it's going everywhere. It's all right. I'm so, I, I promise. It's I'll all right. You're not cleaning up. Oh, I will. I will. Don't worry. Okay. All, right. all of it? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, this is really going to make a mess when we burst. But you see it. what I mean? There is plenty of confetti in there. There is a Just hell of a lot. Yeah, yeah, you could probably get two of these out of that packet, but you know, bigger is better, right? I, I agree. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, that's, that's, that's. That'll do. Okay, there you go. That'll do. That'll, do. That'll do. Let's, let's tidy the table. Perfect. Yeah. No one will have a clue. Okay, so that's in there. Next thing we want to do is to put some five inch in there. Okay, so we're just going to pop our balloons into here now. Um, is that a speciality tool you've got? There? It's a it's a chopstick. Okay, right, from the finest local Chinese takeaway. Okay, so yes, it is a speciality tool. Absolutely. Um, I've left this rolled down as well, and that just means that when we're inflating these balloons, they're right into the body of the balloon. None of them are getting trapped in the neck okay. of the reflex, yeah? yeah. yeah. Um, and then we're just going to count the pumps when we pop this in there. And um, that's just so that they're sized the same. Again, if you don't want them to, you have all various, various sizes in there. And we're just going to fit, I'm going to do five probably, um, because we don't want to waste everyone's time down the camera. Yeah. Um, but you can probably get 12, 13 in there. Yeah, yeah. So I've gone with three pumps. Yeah. Tie the neck, and again, leave the neck if you want to. I like to snip them off, so we'll snip that one off. So you're not really doing that for any weight benefit, because this is air. It doesn't matter. So. Uh, I'm just doing it for neat and tidiness. Neat and tidiness. If that's the term. It is now. Perfect. Personalised your pump as well. Absolutely. Very nice. Absolutely. We've all got them in the uh, in the office. Yeah. It was a COVID thing. Oh, Rather yeah, than I sharing suppose, the hand yeah. pumps, yeah. Um, so they were all personalised. <clears throat> Makes sense. Did you see our show we did when we went to Bubblegum Balloons? Uh, I did see it, did yeah. you see how everything, they, all their benches have got... If, if, Every, it's, yeah. everything so if you've got the, the green sticker for instance your your pump has got a green sticker on it your, your bench has got a green sticker on it your everything has got a green sticker on it so everybody knows it's great isn't it, it goes to the that same place it's funny how all these adaptations and changes we've made along the way and, and now they're just sort of second nature you yeah, just kind of do yeah. it don't you we're not quite there yet with that 
So somebody will still borrow scissors off somebody's workbench and they'll end up on somebody else's. They, they shouldn't, in theory, because every workbench should have some scissors. Yeah, it's true, <laughs> it's true. But scissors, I don't know if it's like the same here. Scissors are the one thing that goes walkabouts all the time. Yeah. I don't, we, we probably go through scissors, I don't know. You must go through 12 pairs a year. I don't yeah. know where they go. There must be a, <laughs> a hole somewhere. Well, I've found with pens. So if I, I, leave, I leave pens in the meeting room. You know, we do recruitment and get people to do stuff. I always want a pen there. Yeah. And invariably, they all go missing. It's just because people pick them up, they use don't them, think anything and they it. take them out yeah. or leave them on the desk or whatever. Yeah. And um, so what I've done, this is ingenious, absolutely ingenious. I'll be impressed with this. I put a cup on the table and put pens in the cup. And people okay. tend to put them back in the cup. Spot the cup and don't don't pop them in their pocket. Exactly, genius. Oh, genius. Well, I think it's genius. I think it's clever. I think it is clever. Right, this is number five. I uh, was just having a few issues with that last one getting yeah. trapped, um, so I just started again. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just bring it back out and go again. What was it? The neck was twisted or something? Do you think? I think so. Yeah. You got same issues. Same issues. You're doing yeah. this on purpose. So that's all right. Demonstrate. Doesn't matter. So let's push that balloon out of the way. See if that helps too. Yeah, because of course you're pushing against other balloons now when you're inflating it. Absolutely, so. yeah. But you can see here on this side of the balloon, there's still a lot of baggy yeah, balloons, yeah. so we can just try and fill that piece instead. Right. There we go. Perfect. I think we'll stop at five. Okay, next thing I'm gonna do is unroll that neck now. Mm -hmm. We've filled our confetti, we've filled our balloons, we've done what we wanted to do. Get rid of the air out of the clears. Yeah. So you want that to be as tight as possible. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. yeah. We want, yeah, we don't want any air in the clears if we can help it. And now we're gonna inflate the reflex um, and the, the clears will go, we'll expand with it. Okay, right, so my, at the minute, my ready to pop is right on the seam. That's not very good, is no, it? No, it's not great. So I'm gonna put some air into the clears and just, in fact, I might be able to get away without doing that. I might just be able to spin it round a little bit. Oh, look at that. There we go. Let's try again now. Obviously, if we didn't have the printed version, it wouldn't matter, but. <laughs> Scares me, you're getting it's quite big now. I think that's plenty big enough. We could go bigger, but there's no need to. Um, so the next thing I want to do is just to make sure that there is no, uh, there's not a gap between the clears okay. and the, uh, it's just a push down. You can hear that air escaping. Oh, right. And that was the air from the clears okay. coming out of the hole. I've kept hold of my yeah, yeah. neck and my reflex here. So what I've seen Chris do before is sort of- Push it round. Push it round. Either, either way, yeah. that, that also does the trick. Um, next thing is to um, tie our, our reflex off. So I'm going to tie a knot in the top here. Mm -hmm. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to shove the knot inside the clears. So that, I don't know if it makes a difference, but in my mind, if, if I don't shove the knot in there and that's tied in whilst I clip, tie off the clears, I'm actually popping the inside balloon anyway. So what's yeah. the point? Yeah. I may as well have everything that pops. Okay, yeah, I see what you mean. I don't know if it makes a difference at all, but in my mind, it makes a difference. Yes. So I've just pulled on the neck, twisted it round, and then I'm gonna lock it off with 260. Like that. So is it at this point, if you wanted to personalize it, you say you didn't have this balloon, you had a plain one, would you personalize it now? Yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get it onto my base and then I would personalize okay. it. 
um, all at the same time. Now it's fully inflated, then we can add our personalization. Yeah. Uh, right, so that's one knot on there. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna fold back the, the neck of the clears again. Mm -hmm. uh, again, just a, a security safety thing. I just wanna make sure that no air escapes. Belt and braces. Absolutely. There we go. Locked into place. Um, like I said right at the start, I'm not doing a design as such today. Um, all I've made is a really simple base for it today. Yeah. Um, and that can live on the top of this. Just pulling that 260 right the way through. Tie a knot in there, make sure. Ping, ping. There we go. Okay. So there we have it in its uh, simplest form. The next thing we need to do is, and this is the bit that makes sure that it doesn't go down, and that's to add the stretchy balloon tape. Okay. All right, so we don't need a huge amount, probably an inch, just over an inch, something like that yep. is absolutely fine. Um, and in terms of location, we don't want anything um, too near the seam. Um, we're gonna come away from the seam, but also we don't want it too near the, the middle of the balloon either. Um, so would you have it effectively at the at the back of the balloon. You can do, absolutely, yeah. If you've got a column that has a front to it, then yeah, yeah it might be an idea to put yeah, it at the back. Yeah. Um, but obviously today it's a bit of a 360 anyway. And then I would also add vinyl at this point that says, you know, pop here. A little yeah. arrow oh, that says right, pop okay. here, something cool. like that. So that, like I say, that's the click, click, stretchy balloon tape. We wanna make sure that's really firmly stuck down. Yeah. Um, and then in the next, we're gonna come back to this in 20, 25 minutes. And the reason why we give it 20, 25 minutes is to allow the film on the clears to, to settle into position because we stretched it a lot. We need it to settle down. And we also need to make sure that this, this um, stretchy balloon tape has done the same. Okay. So we've stuck it down really hard whilst it's at its most tense state. So it's going to relax a little bit. So now. this will contract, the, the clears will contract a little bit onto the latex. Uh, not contract as such, just the film sort of relaxes into position. Okay. Um, so it, when you inflate the clears normally, you'll, you'll notice it's slightly taller than it is wider than okay. the first 10 minutes. Oh, I see, okay. And then it goes perfectly spherical. Okay, so this is to get it spherical. Effectively. Basically, yeah, just to let that film sit, relax into its, uh, into its... So you wouldn't want to personalize it just yet? No, you can do. Oh, you can, it's, okay. it's not as much as that. Okay. It's just, just okay. to give it some time. All right, so what should we do for 25 minutes? Um, it's a warm day. Do you want to go and yeah. catch some rays? Let's, let's go out and catch some rays. Yeah, good idea. Come on, let's go. Two hours later. Quite enjoyed that. That was nice. That was wasn't quite, it? quite it's it's rare. Quite that I, I, I do that. Anyway. It's nice to have an ice cream. I've not had one for a while. I know. I know. Oh, good. Good and timing. Someone's tidied it up, Jacob. Oh, bit of pain so. in the bum, isn't it? Anyway, but I, they've put this over here. Thankfully, they've not burst it. So no, I'll, I'll, I'll bring it back. What are we. So what are we doing now? You're going to demonstrate it. Yeah, so we're going to, we're going to pop it now. Um, so this is all settled. Settled. We've given it time. Um, so now we, we're going to pop it and we have hopefully vinyled it to say pop here and pointing at our yeah. piece of stretchy balloon so you've tape. Got a piece of stretchy balloon tape, but this is facing this way. Um, but for, so for the it's, camera, it's we're going to have that. It's two-sided. Okay. Okay. So you can see they're ready to pop on the other yeah, side anyway. Yeah. So it doesn't really matter too much. Um, Pin-wise, that one wasn't a sharp one. That one's broken off. We need a, a pin, um, and ideally, something out of your, your sewing box is great. Yeah. Really fine. Okay. You don't want anything too thick. Okay. Um, and I would suggest that you supply this to your customer too. Okay. All um, right. Otherwise, they'll come at it with a knife, and you don't okay. want that. And that'll just burst everything. That'll burst everything. Okay. Absolutely. Fingers crossed then for this. Oh, it'll work, Greg. Okay. Believe All right. Me. Are you ready? Yeah. Hey, it worked! It, it does worked. work, absolutely. So now if you, it scared if you, me a little bit. If you just hold your hand over there, you'll see there's no air coming out of that whatsoever. So how, how, how is that? Is that because... That stretchy tape now is just sort of just, contracted and okay. closed that back off. So when we've done this before, we've left it for well over 12 hours yeah. and it still looks like that. There's no creases come onto the clears or anything like that. So anyone that's got a, a gender reveal event, it's only going to be an afternoon or, even, or an evening. Yeah. It's going to last all of that time, no problem whatsoever. That's brilliant. Yeah. That's but if you wanted to, belt and braces again, you could, yeah, you could, you could put another Absol bit of, if you, you could if provide you, another bit of tape for them to put over if that you if they want to. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. For me, I just want them to enjoy their moment and not panic about covering yeah. it back over. Yeah, absolutely. Um, 
So if you were to not use the stretch, let me put this down here now. I know we've 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 done, we've done it. Let's put we? it on. Let's put it on the little stool there, so we can still see it. So if we were to not put the stretchy balloon tape on there, yep. and you were to try that, would would the whole thing burst? I I, I believe so. Yes. Um, okay. I, we haven't done it without the stretchy balloon tape. We haven't tried alternative tapes. Yeah. Uh, the, we got to but the it stretchy works. tape and I mean, it, works. it works. So we didn't so. we didn't need to try anything else. Okay. Um, but yes, and, yeah. and for me, this is a much better alternative as well to those giving money balloons. You yeah. Know, the one with the, the the money that's hanging below a balloon, yeah. healing yeah. field. Yeah. That the idea of that terrifies me. They they worry me as Absolutely. well. Absolutely, losing two hundred pounds to the to the air. You can tell your customer to only untie it indoors, but that just terrifies me. Yeah. So this is another great alternative to that. Um, you we, definitely have to get them to sign a disclaimer for one of those balloons. Oh yeah, a hundred percent. Absolutely. 100%. It just it's scary. So this is a good alternative for that. Um, we did one for New Year's, which is another you know bang on midnight pop yeah. celebration. Yeah. Um, there's got to be a way of doing um, a proposal or something like that as well. There's so many ways that I think people would be able to use this. Yeah, yeah. No, I really like the idea. So you call it the TikTok balloon thing because people do, you see it on that's TikTok. That's where I saw it first. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. So that's that's why I arrived at that name. But yeah. yeah. No, that's brilliant. Good well, Jacob, thank you so much for that. Now, as a guest thank on you. BMTV, you get to ask the question of the week. Yes, So what, what is the question of the week for everybody out there? Um... So what is your alternative use for this then? What is your alternative use for this process? Okay. Um, what are you going to use it for away from gender reveals? Away from gender reveals. Yep. What else could it be used for? Leave yep. your comments down below on Facebook and on YouTube. Jacob, thanks again. Thank you. And thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button and the little bell icon, and you'll be notified every time we upload a new show. And check us out on Instagram as well. Stay happy, stay positive, and I'll see you next week. Bye.